like ghosts <laughs> video and once again we're doing the intro <laughs> in the car it's just way too stressful uh, at home get ready all the stuff and then like film the intro as well it's like too overwhelming we are on our way to pick up the kids you might be curious what we've been packing and getting ready for so we are having a small trip yes overnight one mm -hmm. one night overnight one overnight trip Mm. Yes, we are going to explore Seoul. <laughs> yeah, since we live kind of like not very far away from Seoul, but like in order to like really experience a little bit like the night scene in Seoul mm -hmm. and to just be a little bit more far away from um, the border where we are, we thought it might be fun to just do one overnight and uh, yeah, also we will then show you how it is to like make a one two day one night city trip mm -hmm. <laughs> in Seoul with two small little kids I'm actually very excited about it I already looked for like some nice places and restaurants and cafes let's see we cannot do everything now we are picking up Fanta and Ardo at daycare and yes before we are going to continue with this vlog i'm just gonna quickly introduce the sponsor for this video which is Ana Luisa. and you can see i'm wearing like some pretty nice jewelry pieces i really love them because they are simple but still beautiful they are timeless which i actually love because it's like you can wear them every day every time they don't go out of style and also their quality is amazing because i can shower in them i went on the beach with them i went into the water with them i did everything with them some of the pieces i wear like every day i don't even put them out and as you can see over the years like my Ana Luisa a jewelry collection actually grew and I think it will keep growing because I'm really a big fan of these nice pieces
There are so many points that I absolutely love about this brand. So first of all, you can elevate your style without breaking your budget because like some of their pieces, they start at $39. And this is like an amazing price for this type of quality. They are not bulky. They are, I think, exactly perfect for my age. <laughs> and lastly, their shipping is so fast. Like they have free shipping in the, in the US, but internationally, their shipping is like super fast. I remember every time I ordered something, I was amazed by, about how quick the stuff arrived since I'm like in South Korea. Right now, Ana Luisa is having like the biggest sale of the year, which is up to 30% off. And the more you buy, the more you will get discount. So make sure to grab this opportunity because also now we're in the end of November, right? So it's the perfect time to also get some gifts for Christmas. Make sure to check it out. The link is in the description box below. And now, ah, you stopped at the penny job? Mm -hmm. You hungry? <laughs> because we always care our baby food, but we need to also eat. Yes, we, we brought some baby snacks, but we didn't bring any snacks for us. So yeah, palikato. What is this name? Hatba. I think we always eat this palinja food. No. Maybe only in vlog. <laughs> no, we don't eat so much actually. Yeah, but we always feel. Ah, the people <laughs> think. Yeah. Oh, mine is so. Mm. Make this. You only eat this. What? Soda. Right? Yes, I don't like soda usually, but this sometimes I like. Bultak, sanga kimbap, bibim chamchimayo. Chamchimayo. Sogogi. Sogogi, sogogi gochujang. Ah, gochujang. Finally in the hotel, it's crazy. It took us two and a half hours. Like during the day, sometimes when I come to Seoul, like this area, it's usually like 40 minutes. And now because it's Friday evening, it took two and a half, like literally two and a half hours. So we are really actually in like trip mode because it really feels like we like went to another country because when I leave from my hometown and drive for two and a half hours, I'm in Austria, I'm not in Italy anymore. <laughs> now we're here, I just did the um, check-in and now to just went to the toilet and then we are ready to go and just explore uh, Myeongdong. As you have seen, the Christmas lights are on. I totally forgot about that. I actually wanted to go visit the stream. There's like one stream is super popular. I remember like a few years ago, it was like the team, the like BTS team. Now, I don't know if we're gonna go until there since the street lights here for the Christmas season are already very beautiful. But if we have time, if the kids conditions allows us we will walk onto that stream because it's really very beautiful and they have always another team so let's see which team they're gonna have this uh, right now 
and yeah I don't know he keeps eating the bread that I brought he's really a big fan of my bread I'm so happy about that because yeah I mean it turned out very good this time it turned out very good and I must say the best sourdough bread that I've done so far so I'm very happy I made sure to bring the whole loaf so that it won't get bad I just hope my sourdough will survive like this one and a half days outside but look at this I mean basta. I mean basta. Basta? Uh, Shada. Shada. Hey. No hard, no? Perfection. <laughs> It was good with brothers. So, I can't see, but as we start. I can't see, but I can't Yeah, but it's a mouse. Yeah, it's a mouse. 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 Delicious. Sorry, we're not gonna eat anything Korean. <laughs> Here, Texas. No, what is this? Texas? Texas? You think it is private party? Uh, I think it is private party. Shadow. Oh, ein Regenbogen. We finally ate food 
but it was so difficult so basically the first place the texas place where we actually wanted to go we didn't go inside because it looked like like a private party or if it was not a private party everyone was drunk inside and it was so full so we were like no better not go there and then <clears throat> Almost every restaurant that we wanted to go, they didn't have a baby chair. So we were like going from one restaurant to the next one, no baby chair. Also, many restaurants are on the second floor or on the ground. And so we couldn't go down with the, the stroller. So it was a mess. But in the end, we were like, just let's just go to, a, to one where they also don't have a a uh, baby chair but still uh, there weren't a lot of people so it was okay <laughs> and but the food was good <laughs> Fanta is getting at the stage where she's like yeah that's then that's the famous of it when Fanta is too tired she gets like this we don't know why <laughs> Anyway, um, yeah, I mean, I would not recommend this restaurant, not because it was not good, but because the people were not really nice. But like, I mean, when I entered, the first thing that I said is like, bah, she's tall. And I was like, I really don't like when people say that. Like, I mean, what should I answer? Wow, you're small. Like, <laughs> usually just smile and say, huh? But yeah, and then when we went outside, Ardo was also still holding the fork and the lady kind of was super angry because she thought like we stole the fork. Like, I mean, we just didn't realize that he was still having it. So, I mean, but other than that, the food was actually very good. And one thing that I would actually suggest uh, for everyone who is with babies, we are very much focusing of about no sugar and no salt especially no salt it's difficult when you go outside but usually solungtang and also samgetan usually those two soups they usually don't put salt inside you need to salt it later so that's perfect so you just have a soup without salt and you can give it to the baby directly so in case you're gonna come to korea and gonna eat in the restaurant with a baby and you're like concerned if they can't eat the stuff in a restaurant because usually every restaurant has has just like one or two dishes so you cannot like have a variety of dishes there so, wow what's this? what's this? ah a squid they have like real squids in front of the restaurant so now let's go and watch the stream come on zum Fluss zum Bachele ist ein Bachele und danach gehen wir heim machen vielleicht schlaft der Arthur jetzt auch heim
Können wir jetzt heim machen? Zeig mal, was hast du gekriegt? Wow, wie bist du? Heier sein. Kim, geh mal eine ins Hotel. Kim. Was denn? Aber ich hier geht du da Aber ich war. Ja. Let's go and check our hotel. Here we go. Here we for Ardo also a baby guard, a bad guard for Fanta. So Ardo will be sleeping here and Fanta with us in the bed. Yogi Papa. Fanta keep shouting. Papa? She she liked this. Ja, das ist mein Body Body machen, gell? Das ist die Dusche. Wow, so eine coole Dusche, gell? Wow, <lacht> Koppel aufpassen. Ich kann das nicht aufpassen. Ah, soll ich aufmachen? Ja, komm mal. Oh, muss ich so zeigen. Wenn du nicht weißt, welches Ah, check mal. Wenn du nicht weißt, welches Lied du willst, dann müssen wir nicht anschalten, gell? Good morning! We are well rested. At least the kids are. Um, not so much, but at least I can say that I slept like a baby. <laughs> the bed was so comfortable, oh my God. We really need to change our beddings because I feel like, I really like the style of our bed, uh, the linen style that we have, like that we have in our bedroom. But I feel like now the linen, like it's still hard, you know, the linen sometimes it gets, like it, linen actually gets, softer and softer with every wash but i feel like this doesn't really get soft maybe i don't use the right softener or yeah i'm totally drifting off topic so today we are exploring so we're exploring a part that is very much in the north it's like north to like myeongdong namdaemun is like the extremely that's where we were yesterday it's like extremely like the middle part of Seoul, like exactly the middle part and this is where also most um, tourists are and the yeah. like the most popular tourists but like I'm the same I've I'm not used to seeing that's that ah okay like the treats the only treats that we give her like major treats like everyday treats is like the vitamins which are like small vitamin C candies with pororo on it yeah. ah okay 
this one. I also get it at the doctor always, so she really likes it. So that's why we're yesterday and today we're like going to explore a little bit the north, northwest part mm -hmm. of Seoul. So I've never, never, never been on that part in Seoul. But first, there's like this one pizza place that I really wanted to go because like it's apparently the most Italian, authentic Italian style pizza. And, and also so much this blue ribbon. Blue ribbon? Yes. Top review or mm -hmm. something? Yeah, 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 like this. Ah, okay. So yeah, I'm very curious if like Let's see. I'm a real Italian. I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna rate this pizza and uh, let's see how it tastes. And since it's like so far away from where we live, um, it's actually today the best day to go. Since we we did the staycation yesterday here in Seoul, we are parking and we are all hungry. So let's see. Eat first, and then we're gonna explore Seoul. It took us like almost half an hour to get ready for like Panta's uh, umbrella and our raincoat and then it stopped raining. But maybe it's gonna start again. Come on, hi. Ganz geilen Platte.
Chickchen Herz. I just wanted to say how cool it is to always like run into like such amazing things here in Korea like in Seoul because there's some always something to do but they will do it like for a longer time it's not like just an up, 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 up until next year they have it so i will come back again because this is like full stamp too uh -huh. ah. like also other stuff like ah, yes, garden like, like and healing yeah. Google Google is. so i will come back again and maybe i will film as well so let's see <laughs> push the puppy 